What's going on guys? Night Rainbow here with another reaction video. And I am returning with the uh, My Little Pony Season 8. Uh, this is going to be episode 14 titled Yakety Sax. Um, so this one actually came out a couple of weeks ago, uh, July 20th I believe. Um, I actually went to go record it and but when the video I downloaded said episode 18. And I tried looking it up, um, and it I saw a list that did confirm that it was episode 18, so I decided to skip it. So when an episode actually, the episode 15 came out, and I saw it said 15, I, I again looked it up, and I saw another list that ended up saying that this episode, Yakety Sacks, it was episode 14. So now I'm kind of confused about the whole thing, so I'm just going to go ahead and watch um, Yakety Sacks now and just upload that one first if it's not if it's wrong if, if it was actually episode 18 then you know whatever i doubt it's, it this story's going to tie in <laughs> into anything else anyway so fairy just go ahead uh get it out of the way so with that said let's go ahead and get this started and see what happens <laughs> Flourishai, Angel. What are we? You live, bro? Huh? Oh, what? <gasps> Some poor creature's in trouble. We have to help it. Listen to that suffering. It must be in horrible agony. This music. What the hell? <laughs> oh, it sounds like a herd of injured chimera. <laughs> or it's Cerberus with Snipolitis and two of its heads and Kennel Cough in his third. Or maybe it's. Isn't Cerberus a guardian of Tartarus, though? What the fuck is that? At least no animal is suffering. Some like weird bagpipe. <laughs> <laughs> well, until now. What the fuck is that? <laughs> okay, so obviously there's gotta be yaks in this. Or it's gonna have something to do with yaks. Oh my god, everyone's freaking out. What is that thing? It's called a Euridophone. It's from Yak Yakistan, where it's actually oh, okay. quite popular. Is it supposed to sound like that? Not exactly. It's known to produce a fairly complicated, melodically rich and harmonious tone. Oh my god. <laughs> Burn this now, please. Hi, Lord Pinky. Yes, I can. <laughs> I can honestly, say I've never heard anything like it in my life. Well, if you enjoy listening to my playing half as much as I enjoyed playing my playing, then I should totally play more! That way we'll be even! Please don't. Oh, I don't think that's necessary, Pinky. Uh, 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 yeah. Yeah. Please, don't. <laughs> There's a chance I may have missed a note or two here or there, but I just love playing so much! Huh? You complete me. Well, I for 
one, I'm glad you're having so much fun with your new hobby. Uh-huh. Sure. Oh my god. And it's great Pinky. that you're learning a new skill and... And you're just waiting for me to finish talking so you can start playing again, aren't you? No! But if you're done... And a one, and a two, and a... I like it. <gasps> Don't. Oh, it's okay. She's gone. <laughs> hey, Pony, don't you think that sounded like an apple core caught up in a pulp grinder? Absolutely. Uh, but absolutely. Okay. Wow. So maybe she isn't good, Rarely. but she's our friend, and we should be supportive. She just started playing. She's bound to get better. Right? Nope. Yeah, we just need to be supportive of her practicing. So the getting better part happens as fast as possible. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pinky. There's like better places you could do that. The giraffe. What's it? Where the hell is the sanctuary? Oh no. Pinky. No, Pinky. Oh my god. Make her pay for those. Ah, you're absolutely right, Spike. Sometimes it is nice to get out of the library and be in the sun. Especially when you take the library with you. Wow. <laughs> but or Twilight. We need to do something about Pinkie Pie's playing. Like now. Is it really that bad? Does this answer your question? Uh a trophy? For second place. Second place! All because of Pinky's playing! And Are I they? wanted to turn heads with my new fall line. But not like this. And thanks to her fruit blast <laughs> melodies, I got a so. full of nothing but applesauce. And it ain't even sauce in season. And just look what her playing did to poor Fluttershy. <sighs> oh, so very tired. It practically took me all night to get the nursery back to sleep. I mean, I know <laughs> right she should all be supportive, but Pinky's been playing for moons now, and she's not getting any better. Yeah, if anything, she's gotten worse. Okay, maybe we can just pretend she's really good, and then I'll find a spell that will- Oh, no, no, no. We're not going through that again. Remember how well it worked out when you weren't honest with Celestia about her acting ability? Yeah. Uh, you're right. We'll just have to tell Pinkie Pie she's not very good at the Ovidophone. That was a nice mention, though. And yeah, it involves your Gavitophone. You mean the thing I love more than anything else in Equestria? My sun, my moon, oh, my God. stars, my everything? Pinky. Ooh, tell me, tell me, tell me! Alright, in all honesty... Uh, oh my in God. all honesty... Rarity has something to say. <laughs> oh my God, AJ. Pinky, please, listen to Rainbow Dash. Uh, For real. Fine. So, Pinky. Remember when we all were shocked to discover Princess Celestia wasn't so good at acting? Yeah, she was awful. But that's kind of a random thing to bring up. I thought you wanted to talk about my Ubidaphone playing. Well, <laughs> Damn and, uh, it. It's just, you need to know the... Twilight? Uh, 
Pinky. We all support you, but we're afraid you're just not good at the Ovidophone. And none of us want you to waste your time on something you can't do well. Oh. Why didn't you just say so? What? <sighs> we were all really nervous to tell you. Why? It's just a silly instrument. Well, lunch break's over. Gotta get back to the bakery. Those apple turnovers aren't gonna apple themselves. No more you better go play for me. Wow. She took that so much better than I feel like she was faking that. Vitaphone playing for me. And a one, and a two, and I don't know what to do. <laughs> Aww. <sighs> Another beautiful day in Ponyville. Uh, Twilight, when was the last time you saw Pinkie Pie? Hmm, not since we told her to stop playing the Vitaphone. I'm still surprised with how well she took it. I don't think she took it as well as you think she took it. Top of the morning, Oh, Julia. Pink Meat is back. Is it morning? I hadn't noticed. That's not good. There you are. We've been looking all over for you. It turns out, Pinky may not have taken our critique of her Uvidaphone playing in the spirit with which it was intended. I saw. Oh my god, what? There's got to be something we can do. I'm sure there is, Spike. We just have to figure out what. I don't get it. So she's no good at playing the Uvidaphone. What's the big deal? There's so many other things she's really good at doing. Yeah. Not being able to play the Uvidaphone is nothing compared to all the things she can do well. And that's exactly what we'll show her. I bet if we get her to do the stuff she likes and is good at doing, she'll cheer right back up and forget all about the Uvidaphone. Wait, that's a great idea. Let's get started. What the hell? Apparently, there's not a moment to lose. Gummy. Well, damn. A little flash pony. Oh, um, <laughs> oh, my God. Um, That's as close as cupcakes as you're everyone's getting, guys. <laughs> oh. Okay. And goodbye. Oh, Jesus. Uh, yeah, that's even worse. <laughs> so, I'm guessing no pony had any success? <sighs> My party cannon idea was a real dud. Don't blame yourself. None of us did any better. Well, not to worry. I came up with the perfect solution. Instead of trying to remind her what she's good at, we'll remind her what she's best at. And that's being our friend. We're gonna throw her a Pinkie Pie appreciation party. That's a wonderful idea. If any pony needs to know how much she's appreciated, it's Pinkie Pie. We can get the whole town involved, just so she can see what a good friend she is to every pony. Then I hereby officially declare today Pinkie Pie Appreciation Day. Uh, you know something's going to go wrong. Now this is perfection. Yeah! If anything can help Pinkie cheer up and make her forget about her Yavitaphone, this is definitely it. Sure is. Okay, who's going to get her? No need. 
Gummy's on it. In fact, there he is now. <laughs> uh, Gummy, you were supposed to bring Pinkie Pie. What happened? Is she still coming? Fluttershy, can you understand what he's saying? I could, if he was talking. Let me try something. Gummy, where is Pinkie Pie? <laughs> Maybe we should just go and get her. Yeah. Uh, what in tarnation is going on here? This decor is dreadful. And all of Pinkie's stuff is gone? It is a puzzle. Excuse me. Oh, oh hi, Mud. Um, Maud, can I ask you a question? You just did. <laughs> well, can I ask you a question? You just did. Ugh. God damn it. <laughs> no. Oh, mistakes. Maud. Jesus Christ. Things are gone. Explain. No, they're not. They're right here. Maud. Have you seen Pinkie Pie? Lots of times. I grew up God there. damn it. Maud. Okay, let's try this a different way. Why did you pack up all of Pinkie's things? She asked me to. What? Pinkie told me to pack up her room and take everything to the rock farm. What? She said she wouldn't need them since she's moving to Yak Yakistan. What? Alrighty then. Terribly sorry, Maud. Must have misheard you. It almost sounded like How you said the Pinkie bed? to Yak Yakistan. Never mind. <laughs> uh, Rarity? She did say that. Terribly sorry, Applejack. I must have misheard you. It almost sounded like you said she did say that. <laughs> really? God, I don't understand. Why would Pinky leave Ponyville? Yeah! Why would she want to go live with the Yaks? She said without the Yavitaphone, her life had no meaning, and at least in Yak Yakistan, she could listen to the Masters play. She hoped that would give her some semblance of happiness. Well, no. No, 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 no. That will not do. I say we go to Yak Yakistan right now and make her come back home. We can't just march up there and tell Pinky what to do. But we didn't even get a chance to say goodbye. Well, we may not be able to go to Yak Yakistan and force her to come home. But we could go say goodbye. And if we happen to mention how much her friendship means to us, and how much we'd miss her if she were gone forever, and then oh, she God. decided to come back home on her own... Then what are we waiting around here for? Let's get going to Yak Yakistan! Jesus. Is that windy? When was the last time we seen that balloon? Pinky's gotta be around here somewhere. But where? Is that the music of the Ovidophone? Are you sure? Because that actually sounds kind of good. Oh, I'm sure. Come on. God damn. Pardon me. Excuse us. Uh, sorry. I feel nothing. Maybe we can help with that. Oh, hey. What are you guys doing here? Just hear us out. We respect your decision to move to Yak Yakistan. But we just wanted to remind you how much you mean to us. And how much we'd miss you if you decided to move here for- Fine. I'll move back to Ponyville. Wow. That was a lot easier than I thought. We're awesome! Pinky, what's wrong? That's what's wrong. I thought coming here and listening to real Yavitaphone playing would make me happy. It makes me feel worse. I'm never gonna sound like them. 
Your Vidophone fan pony watch instrument while Yigrid visit little Yak's room? Eh, if I can't play it, I might as well do menial chores for those who can. Dear God. Okay, so Pinkie Pie is obviously still miserable. Yeah, this is oh, depressing. I can't bear to see her like this. Indeed. But what else can we do? Yeah, we tried everything. Maybe not. Look. <laughs> Oops, sorry. I forgot what an awful Yavidaphoner I am. Playing it makes you so happy. Oh, it sure does. I mean, it did. Then you should never stop. Oh, so yeah. say we all. Absolutely. But you were the ones who told me to stop because I wasn't good. And we were wrong. Playing makes you happy. And as long as it makes you happy, it doesn't matter how good you are. So get up there and show these yaks how it's done. I don't know if you've noticed, but the audience are all yaks. And they kind of have issues with things that aren't perfect. Like my playing. Pinky Pie, you get up on that stage and play. If these yaks don't like it, they'll have to answer to us. Well, okay. If you all say so. <clears throat> uh, it's not going to work out Jessica's too well. Performing for her very first time here. Let's give a big round of stuff for Pinkie Pie. <clears throat> um, hi. So, uh, any yaks here from out of town? Okay. And a one, and a two, and I kind of remember what to do. <gasps> <clears throat> My God. What? What? No. Pony play good set. You think so? Even though it wasn't perfect. Your vidophone is instrument of happiness. Playing your vidophone make pony happy. Pony playing is perfect. Well, if that's the case, let me play you the song I just wrote two seconds ago. It's called, I've got the best, most supportive friends a pony could ever ask for. It's a working title. And a one. And a two. And a you know what to do. <gasps> Ow. <laughs> okay, uh... <laughs> That was interesting. Oh my god. <laughs> so, I love that callback to uh, the Celestia acting episode earlier in the season. That was a nice little touch. And, as I said, I think that was... We got pretty close to cupcakes uh, in this episode, but that's the closest we're going to get. Interesting to see uh, Pink Amina return, though. Even though it is kind of weird that they did the whole uh, uh, Season 2 premiere thing with her losing her color. I, I mean, I get the... I get I get the appeal of doing that is to make her seem depressed, but you know, it just seem seem kinda of weird to do it, but uh yeah. <laughs> it's it, like I, I wasn't expecting to see Pigamina again. So um other than that, you know, just kind of a generic episode. Um I'll admit like uh, of all the episodes this season, this is probably my least favorite so far. I don't hate it, but, you know, it wasn't, you know, all that exciting to me. Um, but yeah, like, it's not too bad, but there's nothing too great about it either. Um, yeah, I got nothing else for it, so. Um, that was episode either 14 or 18 or whatever the hell it is they're calling it. Uh, it's Yakety Sacks. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Take it easy. Man,